New Jersey is a love-hate relationship for me. Uh, you know, being my home event and all, and it being not one of my favorite tracks. But over the years, I'm beginning to appreciate it more because we have to drive here every single year, and it doesn't look like that will stop anytime soon. So I just learned to kind of appreciate the, I guess, the technical side of what the track is because it is kind of a hard track to drive. There's a lot to it. Uh, but I have a lot of family and friends that come down to support, which is phenomenal. I mean, it makes, it makes you feel more at home, which is great. It's definitely, uh, definitely much different than it used to be back in, back in the old days. Well, I mean, even thinking back when I first competed uh, here at Wall for the first time in 2007, up until where we're at now, it's definitely leaps, leaps and bounds different. Just, you know, having the program where it's at and the support from the sponsors and having a, f a really great fan base and fans who appreciate everything and, um, and su support me whether I win or lose, you know, it's just a really good feeling all around. The car is always a work in progress. Um, you can always find something to do and if, if you're if you're not learning or finding something new to do to the car to make it better, then you're just staying stagnant and that's what's going to uh, inevitably beat you in the end. So it's, it's nice to have a team that's really hungry to win. I'm John Hoyanga, president of Nameless Performance. Ryan's really good to work with. I mean, he's, he's a kind of driver that knows the mechanical side of the car, understands how it's put together and what it needs, what it likes. Ryan's 13 years of drifting experience definitely bring a different dimension to our setup. Where we have a lot of experience in setting cars up, he has a lot of experience driving cars. We, we set the car up how we think it would be best uh, for the track that we're running. Uh, and then we go out there and practice the first day and pretty much all of our setup not goes out the window, but it's definitely smashed against reality pretty heavily. just moved on from top 32 in the big show top 16 we're up against Pat Gooden uh, really good lead lap it's it's I was leading first so it's really uh, easier to collect your thoughts knock the jitters out of your system and then go out for a solid chase lap and that's exactly what we did now we have our scion teammate Ken Gushi in a round of top 16 so uh, he's gonna be a tough tough competitor phenomenal car phenomenal team they got a really good setup and uh, he's driving a heck out of it so it's uh it's gonna be bittersweet win or lose but uh, we're hoping we move on to top A. We need some points for the championship, so we're hoping to move on. Wrong, took out a clip pretty bad, and um, Gucci got the win. It was basically, you know, the, the run of the least amount of mistakes, and Gucci did that. So, this top 16 stuff is getting old for me. I want to, uh, I want to start getting on that podium and uh, fight for a championship. So, we're gonna come into Montreal swinging and um, hopefully get a win. Uh, we had a good qualifying run, which gave us a little bit of an advantage. And going into the chase, I, I was trying to stay close, but I ended up choking on the inner cliff, took that down quite, quite bad. But uh, Justin had a couple mistakes on his own. He's straight now going into turn two. So the second run being a 50-50 wash, we ended up taking the, the win based on the first run. 
take it. We're moving on. Top eight, here we come. Well, here we are guys. We just finished our final four battle against Chris Forsberg and unfortunately I was just being a little bit too aggressive on a chase. Ended up tapping his door, taking myself out, sacrificing that first run. I came back after five minutes on my lead lap and uh, the alignment was just still too off. Ended up taking up a cone and uh, taking a loss. So uh, we ended up in uh, fourth place today, which isn't that bad, um, but we do want to continue to get on that podium and uh, strive for that top spot. So. So thanks guys for following us, stay tuned for the next show.